Quick reminder! We started playing Dragon Ball Xenoverse on my channel and we finished the Scion Saga and I'm planning to finish the Ginyu Saga today! Thanks for being here today! The first thing I did was to talk to Tian and become his apprentice. You can become an apprentice for many in-game characters in Toki Toki World. That helps you unlocking new super abilities. Some stronger and some, not so strong. After talking becoming Tian's apprentice I did some of the side quests and leveled up a little bit. In this timeline Ginyu changed bodies with Vegeta first to have enough power to fight Goku and switch with him and guess what? We have to correct that. Our first step is to fight Ginyu to an extent or completely beat Rikun. I just finished this part with beating up Rikun. Our next step is to finish off the rest of the Ginyu squad together with Goku. Well theoretically you just need to beat Ginyu but I just beat up everybody. But then, the plot twist happens. Through an accident we happen to change our body Ginyu and have to play with his ass moveset for a while. After beating up the three of them Goku asks us to go help Gohan and our little bald guy to get the Dragon Balls. But we get ambushed and our task now is to defeat 20 fucking enemies. After getting the Dragon Balls we fight Ginyu one last time to finally correct the timeline. After Ginyu lost enough health I get my body back and Ginyu switches with Goku. And once the story is canon again we just beat all the enemies and the Ginyu saga is... Almost finished. We meet Toa and Mira, the main villains for now. They're the reason for the changes in time and now we have to fight Mira. We end the fight and both of them escape. Like, subscribe and follow me on Twitter or else... Perish!